Hi, today we're going to have fun. We're going to cook some delicious uh, biscuits and gravy. And I'm using my 12 inch Dutch oven here. It's made by Camp Made. I have like 20 briquettes on the bottom. I preheated it for about 10 minutes. So let's pull the lid off. Yeah, it's nice and hot. So I have two pounds of Jimmy Dean sausage. So what we'll do first is we'll get this sausage cooking. Set that like that. Just kind of scramble this up. We'll just scramble this up. Once the sausage is all browned and cooked, uh, we'll go to the next step. And so uh, we'll see you back in a little bit. Okay, the sausage is cooking. It's doing good. It's down there sizzling away. We're going to make the biscuit part of it. And it's a damper bread recipe. And I've done this a few times. I love it. It's so easy. But I have three cups of self-rising flour here. And then you use a cup of lemonade. But I guess I was so excited at the store, I grabbed limeade. So it's, this is going to be different. But the lemonade, and we're using limeade this time, it gives you the water and the, the sugar in one... Uh, one ingredient, and then we have a cup of whipping cream here. Pour that in. It's going to be yummy. Just mix this up. Pretty good, but just kind of mix it till you get a pretty good dough consistency. It can be a little lumpy. Oh, did you see that flour shoot right out of the bowl? <laughs> <laughs> got my arm look at that mm -hmm. yeah I'll just kind of mix this get it a good consistency and we'll make some little little balls to for our biscuits and then uh, yeah that'll turn out good so we'll see you back okay we're ready to go to the next step the sausage is cooked so I pulled it out of the Dutch oven we're gonna make a roux now so I added a little butter there to the sausage grease and we'll just sprinkle some of this on the bottom Trying to stir this up. Maybe I put a little bit too much flour. What do you think, baby? I think you need more butter. Yeah. So I'll just play with this. Let's do a little more butter. So I'll just keep stirring this. Can you go get a little more butter? I was excited. Yep. I put a little bit too much flour. Okay. That's we'll okay. Here we go. We added about three or four tablespoons of milk and about a quarter more cube of butter but let's put the rest of the flour in there and then we're gonna do seven cups of milk so we'll just do this yeah that's gonna be awesome Two. we'll do this that was four I want to talk but I'll lose track of how many milks I'm putting in here. So let's just get done with the milk and then we'll talk a little bit. Okay. There we go. We'll set that there. <clears throat> let's stir this up a little bit. Get this good and going. All right, yeah. We're camping. We're at a... Uh, we're in Idaho, and it's called Maple Grove Hot Springs, and so there's a reservoir down there. It's Oneida Reservoir. It's off the Bear River. It's pretty cool, and then they have hot pools down there, and we're going to go down later tonight and soak in the pools and just have a good time. But we'll cook these biscuits and gravy for about 40 minutes at 375. So there's that. Now let me grab the sausage. Put the sausage down in here. Oh yeah, look at that. It'd be pretty good. So there's that. Now, 
I think what I'm going to do, well, I know what I'm going to do. The biscuits are next. So let's grab this. See that? That made some good. So I'm just going to spoon, spoon some of this dough in here. Just kind of float it right in here. Go in a little circle. Yeah. Biscuits might be all different sizes, but that's okay. It'll taste the same, huh? Get this in, and then we'll let this go. Once it starts boiling, <clears throat> once it gets to that boiling point, that's when the, the homemade gravy starts to thicken up nice. So what I'll do is I think we'll get this going, and then we're going to check it in probably 30 minutes. We'll get some seasoning going. I think we're going to leave it like that. So let's get this. See, I had 20 briquettes on the bottom to cook the sausage, so we need to adjust the heat. So let me pull that off. And we want 10 on the bottom. So they're kind of, they're burned down a little bit, so I think I'm just going to stay with about a dozen on there. And that was actually a little hot, so I'm going to put my glove on. Pull that. Like that and then we want 16 on top so they're burned down a little bit so I'll probably put about 18 but I'll just spread these briquettes on here we'll just let this do its thing for about a half an hour then we'll be back to see how it's going so we'll see you back okay Jenny couldn't wait any longer it's only been 20 minutes so let's check and see how this is going this oh, holy smoke that is looking not sweet yeah pretty sweet awesome <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> oh my gosh yum look at those biscuits just bubbling right there so i figured about 40 minutes so let's give it another 15 we'll just shy it up five minutes and see how it is but we want those biscuits to be Nice and golden brown, but the way that gravy, it's bubbling up, so I think it's going to be good, so we'll be back shortly. Okay, I think we're, we're done here. The biscuits smell awesome. We're sitting right over there, and I just keep getting whiffs of this, and it smells so delicious. Let's check this out. Oh, Holy smoke. Gosh. It's golden brown on that side, but I want to give this five more minutes. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, spin let's it. let's give. It, I'm going to spin the Dutch oven uh, half a turn, and let's get those a little bit more. But look at that gravy! Look how good that's thickening up. That is awesome. Our sausage coming up through the door. Okay, so that's the plan. We'll do five more minutes, and then we'll eat. So we'll see you back. Okay, we're ready. It's ready to serve up. So, check this out. Holy smoke. Look at that. Those biscuits are awesome. I'm going to scoop some of this out. Yeah, see how that cooked? That just cut right through that biscuit. Look at this. Whoa. We'll flip it over the back side so you can see. But look at that. That is delicious. <laughs> Nothing like cooking in the outdoors. So let's, I'm gonna set this here. That plate's a little hot and we'll put a little pepper, a little salt. Let's try this out. Try the sausage. Mm. Yummy. Oh, that gravy turned out great. Right from scratch. Biscuit's going to be hot, so be careful. Mmm. Delicious, but look at that. Look how that cooked all the way through. We just dropped those balls of dough down in that gravy. It cooked up amazing. The plate's hot. The food is hot. And delicious.
Hope you like this video. We'll see you next time.